Hello everybody and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3 where I just noticed my character portrait looks awesome. I didn't get to change it around like you do in Dragon Age Origins. Uh, it's uh, four stars only out of five. Uh, no, um, by the way, at some point I, I have to stop playing for a bit because uh, I can't have the air conditioner on while I am playing because the air conditioner in this hotel is so loud it like registers as loud as my voice does on the microphone. So, that's where we're at with that. And this is hell. Uh, I saw the tagline for this place is at my, uh, the pod in hell or whatever, I don't know. Um, also, apparently you can drag stuff around. Someone else got out. I know, oh man, okay. So, I haven't played, have a look. I haven't played Destiny, or Destiny, Divinity in ages. Dead. Good. Good. Um, ugh. This is the pool that Bing came from. The parasite now writhing behind you. Oh, eye. don't say that! Investigate, can I? Ooh, ooh, it's a, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Guys, I have been wanting to play Dungeons and Dragons for so long. I've been wanting to play it, but I can never, like my friends and I, we can just never get it worked out. We're all super busy. You know, we all live far apart. I've been even tempted to like find like uh, find groups online from like D and D podcasts I like because they have like group finding functions in their discords, and I've been tempted to do that. But I have been I told you <clears throat> I told you guys earlier I've been making characters up in like like D and D characters up in my free time, and now I get to play. <sighs> um, I did see somebody said that there's like a the dice are like weighted in your favor. I think by default. Um, I'm not necessarily opposed to that. I'll have to, I'll have to think about it a little more. It would be nice to, maybe I will not actually, I'll turn it off, but if it starts being bad, I'm going to turn it back on. <laughs> Ooh, skill check. Some dialogue options require a skill check. A dice roll that you must meet or exceed the target number. Your character skills add a bonus to that roll. It's nice, it's interesting too that they're like actually doing the dice roll, whereas like some games will like hide the dice roll. Like Dragon Age Origins um, was inspired heavily by like Final Fantasy and Baldur's Gate back when Bioware made it. Um, and so, or they were heavily inspired by D&D. And so like they, and Bioware did make the Baldur's Gate one and two. Um, and they coder also, um, and so you'd, you'd have kind of the numbers like in the stats, but like they would hide the dice rolls essentially. You wouldn't see it. Um, you'd just see the outcome type thing, um, which I don't mind that either. But this is gonna be fun. This is like actual Dungeons and Dragons. I w oh, I wonder if you can get like dice skins. I would love to do. That. Oh, you can. No, my friend. That's right. My friend. He gave me the code for this, but he did take the dice skin. Which is good because I double checked. I wanted to make sure that all the codes he gave me were mine and I wasn't stealing any of his. But he wanted the dice code and that's 100% great. Um, but I just realized now, yeah, they do have dice. They have dice skins. Ooh, that's so fun. Okay. Oh, click the dice to roll. I'm so excited. The difficulty. And you can see the difficulty too. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> 18. <laughs> Perfect. That's a high roll. The casing roll. is fragile. The slightest touch could cause it to crumble. Poke. I'm gonna poke it. Oh, okay. Well, all right. It didn't say it would explode. Also, I have to keep going. It just said it would crumble. I was hoping to get something out of it. I wonder if there's like um. I know in Divinity, I was constantly surprised about like the depth to which you could like actually interact with your environment. Might be other survivors. And so mm -hmm. I am, I am eager to see that. And it, and there was some games, at least in like Origins, I guess, you press tab. Might still be stuck inside if we hadn't been attacked. And you can see all the things that you can poke. I wonder who was inside. I, uh, I did. I briefly looked at the, um, the, what do you call them, the, the keybinds, um, because I am using mouse and keyboard, I'm not sure how, I don't, I don't even know if they have controller Here we go. capability, I'm sure they do, but, alright, blue tentacles are good, 
Uh, why is I was like, why does it look like a sphincter? And it is labeled a sphincter. Awesome. I remembered. I I was like, why does it look like a bow? And I my I remember now. My friends did mention that they, there was like a door named sphincter, and I was like, I had no idea what they were talking about. Now I do. Now I do. Why? Why are we in the butt of the mind flayer living uh, ship? One thing I did have some difficulty with for a while with Divinity was the fact that I couldn't move my character with WASD. It's just the camera. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what's this? Hang on. <laughs> oh, my ADD. My ADD brain is like... Like, yeah, I hear you, I hear you, but what's this? <laughs> <laughs> the voices are talking, but I want to know, uh, let's see, you said, no, nope, hang on. There we go. Okay. We are here. Oh! Wait, I wasn't done over there. I'm not done. Go back down. I thought you were talking. No, okay, they must be a little further up. Fire, thank you. Well, and I, what I really loved about Divinity was that, like, you the way you could interact with, like, your... Whoa. Uh, okay, no, that looks like the way I'm supposed to go. Never mind, never mind. Back, 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 back. Oh, what? What did I... Oh, I think I got in the fire. But the way, like, you're, you, you could interact with your environment... What the heck? Am I on fire? Was it? It was like a. Okay. Oh my gosh. Why? Why so much pain? Oh geez. Who is that in there? Oh my gosh. There's a freaking fly in my face. Why can't I poke you and retrieve whatever you are? We are trapped. Okay. That's great. I'm. That's great. Uh, oh, oh, um. Yes, ah! come to save us from this place. From this place, you'll free us. The exposed brain quivers uh, in expectation. Succeeded perception. Please. Before they return, they return. Ooh, I love okay good she's like yeah hmm oh you're obviously talking to a brain uh you sound afraid why the enemy so many enemies uh, I um who am I talking to a newborn born new from this husk you know no creature like oh this. no one that is more brain than person. Destroy. Okay, well, tell me what to do. Let's see. Remove us from this body. From this case. Free us. Now, I... Mm, please. Uh, let's try... In, ooh, dexter... Oh, dang. De my, my dexterity isn't great. Investigate. Okay, not bad. You notice edema, a swelling of the brain causing pressure where it strains against the shell of the skull. Okay. Uh, I do, I was like, I think I have advantage on medicine as a, I mean, I feel like it's something I should destroy. Oh, but. I guess I could destroy it later? I don't know. Ooh. <laughs> wow, good. Oh, jeez. Yay, yes, I understand. The brain lifts from the skull. 
Do you notice an opportunity? Oh. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more I wonder if that's because of my high roll. Threat. I think that's probably my high roll. Like this is this goes against like paladin like nature paladin oaths like letting this creature whatever it is born from whatever perversion this is. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna let's see if I can. Nope, I'm bad at it. I might just kill it or just not do it. All right, my first failure. Did I kill it? Oh, I made it angry. Oh. Um, is it gonna fight me? Yeah, I don't think psionic things are good, so I'm like not, like not always, but like, Okay, well that's gonna haunt me. Awesome. <laughs> I have done something terrible. I have released something terrible into the world. Uh, I gotta like get into my... I probably should have just destroyed it, honestly. Um, but we're gonna say my character is, uh, is feeling a bit squeamish, a bit wobbly after everything that's going on. Um, so yeah. From now on, we'll destroy talking brains. Oh, hi. Don't kill me, please. I have low dexterity. Nice. This is your end. I. What? Your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon swing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh, hey, we're tied. We're buddies. Oh. My head. What is this? You got a brain worm in there, too. You are no thrall. Flacketh blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. Eh? <laughs> what makes you think I was a thrall? We carry mind flayer parasites. Unless we escape, unless we are cleansed, our bodies and minds will be tainted and twisted. That makes sense, yeah. Within days, we will be gay. Mind flayers. Ugh. We are turning into mind flayers. There must be something we can do. We can do nothing until we escape. That must be our priority. First, we exterminate the enemy. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. We will address the matter of a cure for this infection once we reach the material plane. Wait, there were other there were other things. Ew, people are being eaten. That's gross. Oh, that's so gross. Okay, so sometimes my talking <coughs> options are limited. That makes sense. We are in a high stress situation. <laughs> It makes far more sense for us to have limited uh, conversational options. Uh, combat happens in rounds. The game pauses around you during combat. Okay. Oh boy. Take an action and take a bonus action. I'm already in pain. Yeah. Throw a character or item from the world or your inventory. You could. Somebody did mention to me that if you're a halfling, you can have the druid throw you, or have, uh, no, have Kalak. Kalak can throw you. I think if anybody's strong enough, they can throw something that's small enough, which includes halflings and gnomes, maybe a dwarf. Um. So I think I have to... Oh, gall. What? 
she missed. And then I thought it's all that matters. My what? I didn't hear it. It's actually really quiet for me, and I'm not sure why. I've got it turned up like as high as it can go in the game and on the computer. Uh, actually, maybe I'll heal myself. Because I can do that, haha. -ha. And I will move a little closer to you. That's One day, I'll catch a break. One day, I'll catch a break. Can we do that? Cool. I didn't think I'd get three actions. Victory awaits. Are they not gonna attack? Oh, I have to end turn per person. Oh, I just do that? Nothing will stand in my way. Oh, that's right, you get five healing twice. That's right. Okay, I used my divine sense because I think uh, imps are fiends. So I should be able. I don't want to move, I just want to. Yeah. I did not do as much damage as I hoped. Not sure what this blue is. It makes me feel like there's something else I could do, which is maybe a cantrip. But I don't. I don't want to do a cantrip. I don't think I have one that would be useful right now. Yeah. These are all done. I guess I could move a little more. That's all right. I don't need to. I am fury. I am death. Okay, let's try. There's no particular can or a bonus action that I want to do, so. Victory awaits. You prove surprisingly. Oh, you can see my divine sense. No. Click a companion portrait to take advantage. So she's just, she's right here with us now, but now we have to loot. Ooh. An actual weapon. Ooh, a crossbow. Oh god, inventory management. I'm so bad at that. Dead thrall. Yee. Thanks. Bled, bled, bled. Chasm, just like the opening. Interesting that they point that out. What's inside? A hand axe. What does my yeah my warhammer is good. Moving in. Oh, incinerated mind flare. Ooh. Throw. It's a little bomb. A skull. And a bulb. Thanks. Um, wait, no, that's back the way we went. We want to go out. I'll give it a shot. Tentacle Aquarium. I want to look. Brains. Gross. Oh, I can't zoom in that close. Oh, gross. Can I break it? I broke it. Nothing happened. All right. Thank you guys for the money. I wish you uh, all the best in your afterlife. I hope I hope it's better than uh, this one was, than this life was. 
Okay, I'm just I'm looking at the ooh climbing. Okay. I'm I'm hoping this is the direction I'm supposed to be going. Oh my gosh, that's so cool seeing the dragons out there. Another butt. Why do they look like butts? Why? Oh. Okay, I will I'm gonna go look. Man is <sighs> but he's totally unresponsive. What happened? Touch nothing, but look. This is who is he? Oh She's a friend. We have no time for stragglers. Uh look for a latch. The construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a straight? I mean, you can go. Uh, you might as well be trapped in demon webs. There's no helping you. No, I'll look around. There must be. I um. have contraption next to the pod. They did something to it when they sealed me in. Hurry! Please! Yeah, I wouldn't want to leave. If she's conscious, like, I wouldn't want to. I'm a paladin. I'm a good person. Catch. Console appears dormant. The mechanisms are completely unrecognizable at first, but then you spy an empty socket. Hit it. Uh, okay, hang on. Let's look around for a key. Yes. I'm not an idiot. I have. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't. Um. Oh, hey, it's the brain. Or maybe it's a different. Oh, there's apparently multiple brains. Oh, us. You must be terminated. Dang it! I hope this is one of those brains I, or the brain. One of these is the brain I let out. Otherwise, I feel like it's going to haunt me forever. <laughs> what happened to that thing? Knocked out. Ooh, unfortunate for you. Um, look, I still. Why do I still have all this blue? I don't know what the blue is. Flee, comrade. No, I shall not flee. I wonder if this is worth the cost. What? I wonder if this is worth the cost. Wait, the cost is uh, is killing little things. Should be fine because it's prone. Dice rolled again. What dice rolled again? What are you doing? End your turn. Can't stay idle. Hit it. Okay. Oh yeah. Uh, what are you? Oh, okay. Brain in a jar. Oh, but that's horrifying. Brain jar. Curious. Brain jar, brain jar. Illithid manuscript. Faint images appear in your mind. A brain, a Githyanki warrior, and centuries of darkness. Well, that sounds depressing. Sounds like a journal entry for an illithid. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, well. Is that blood? Neither of us are. Never mind. Neither of us are lockpicky types. Anything of use? So I'm afraid. I will have to hit the thing, or maybe the thrall. I don't necessarily want to leave the room I'm in, because I'm worried. I'm worried I'll miss out on Shadowheart. I don't want to do that. Uh, 
A key! A key, a key! Excellent. Need to find a way forward. Alright. Come on. Oh, I gotta see. Seems simple enough. The console appears dormant. Uh, I have a key. Hang on. It said some popped up something about the inventory. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I did. I was like, I'm trying to use the key on there. Apparently, I'm an idiot. <laughs> the key. I did look. The, I like. I looked a little bit up. I was kind of squinting, so I wouldn't get too many spoilers. But I was like, what's the point of the key? Keys for this. Keys for this. Okay. Um. I thought there would be something in there. To. To help me get her out. Gross. Mysterious liquid. I mean, could I light this on fire and get her out? <laughs> that's that's where I'm at with this. Well, I um, medium toughness. Me, you know, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna break it open. Man up! Don't I don't want to break the pod. I want to break. Come on! Yeah. Okay. Get me out of yeah. This yeah. Thing. I know. I know. Hold on. Don't bother. You're barely oh. dented. Oh. Okay. Well then, this. I'm going to hit it. The console appears dormant. Nothing. The console remains dormant. The mechanisms are completely unrecognizable at first. And then you spy an empty socket. Well, I can't get her out. I think, what, from, I don't know, from what I saw, like, I just now when I was reading, like, kind of glancing through some stuff, um... I don't know, you won't necessarily lose her. Like, apparently she can get out on her own, but I feel like she's gonna be pissed. How many hosts have these gay infected? Dazed woman is trapped Whoa. inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. Viscous chair, that's horrifying. I hear no. something. Oh! Voices. That's disgusting. I hear nothing of the sort. Here, you sit in a chair now, too. Dang. Okay. Open up. Did she just tell that dead body to open up? It's not a chest. Oh, Eldritch Rune. Seems to be part of a bigger machine. All right. Well. Okay, okay, okay. So they've changed some things, maybe. And now I've created a, an acid pool. Awesome. Oh, it's okay. Actually, I don't have to stand right there. I can stand right here. I love my swagger. Look at my swagger. Insert the rune. I'm take, taking way too long at this. I'm like, no. Oh, take a closer look at the powder console. Oh, please. Okay, I have our kind of proficiency. Woo! Made it. The pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart than a machine. That's horrifying. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Yeah, you think? Uh, place my hand on the console. In your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes oh. over you. Connection. Authentic. 
authority. Wow. Okay, so it, I can use this to have like access to like some illithid powers? Oh my gosh. Difficulty two. I hope I make it. Okay, good. <laughs> you feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command. And yield to it. This might be a bad idea, though. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Oh yeah, that was probably a bad idea. Maybe it's growing in there now. You were fine a uh, half a second ago. Oh, quick, come out! Get out of there! I thought that damn thing was going to be my coffin. Thank you. Your mind lurches into her thoughts. Her gratitude is mixed with wariness. Because you have a gith with you. Are they- yeah, they can- you keep dangerous company. I'm a drow. Um... Uh... Did you, uh, did you feel that just now? We were in each other's heads. I did. It must be because of those parasites they put in us. They'll have to wait. We need to get off this ship alive first. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. Okay. Shadowheart. One moment. You got a D20 in there. What's that? It's nothing. Trust me. Oh. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the helm. Now. She's right. Lead on. Girl power, let's go. Run. Okay, good. She's out of it. See, I went up there. I don't know what else is click on What's in here? Cartilaginous chest. Potions. I thank you. I, that is very nice. Oh, hang on. What's that? Slave mind. Another brain. Why am I collecting brains? This doesn't seem like a good idea. Put. Is there anything else? Nothing. To, no. No other buttons. It's just a big giant. Okay. As you place your hand on the pod, you hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. Oh no! This telepathy thing is interesting with all the other people. This reminds me of Mass Effect 2. Oh, this is horrible. This is horrible. Like Mass Effect 2, where the humans get turned into Change goop if you're not fast enough. Changed at the pull of a lever. How? If we are not purified, this may be our fate. Um, is this to be our um, fate? Is that? I feel really bad. I just turned that person. The newborn mind flyer stares at you. Weak and well, dazed. I was like, what now? But I see the little golden glow telling me to go. Okay, well, I'm a horrible person. I just created another mind flare. Look at me creating psionic little brains and mind flares everywhere. I'm a horrible person. This goes against my oath. That's very unnatural. What I just did. Um, yeah, I tried breaking those earlier and it made a caustic acid come out, so. We are nearing the helm. She Once is the inside, expert. Do as I say. Who put you in charge? What is wrong with you? Judgment. The Gith have been fighting the mind flares since they freed themselves. Not only there's any, there's two different types of Gith, and both of them just waste their time fighting each other instead of I mean, they both fight the illithids too, but there's no there's no gith 
that like willingly, like there's no group of gifts that willingly follow the mind flayers. Oh, hello? Hello? Oh no. Oh my god, he just ate his brain. He just ate his brain. No. It just. Oh, but the imps. Oh, okay. The imps will take out an illithid. Alright, I'm not worried about illithids. Oh. Connect the nerves of the transponder. We must escape. Now. Do it. We will deal with the geek after we escape. Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Uh, I'll bring... I must connect the helm. Okay, you're gonna do it? Where's the helm? Way over there. All right, we. Uh, she's gonna run. I'm gonna have her run. Make way. I do worry. I guess. Oh dang. Okay, I haven't. I didn't trigger an attack of opportunity. Okay, is the blue? Oh, the blue is how much I can see now. It's how much my movement is. Fascinating, excellent. Uh, as far as I know, she's a cleric, so she gets to stay in the back. Wait, I don't get to control myself? Oh. Okay, so will it be me? It's gonna be me going up there. Okay, I thought she wanted to do that. She just, she just said it. Well, let's. Now that I've put her at risk, give her a shield. Guiding bolt, oh, holy 46 rate, holy cow. Oh my. On my way. I am just out of the range of all my... Cool, I'm so, apparently I, I'm just an idiot, and I don't, um, but I will cast this. I'm an idiot. <laughs> well, I guess I didn't have any pop-ups, I didn't think I had any actions. But apparently I did, and I'm just gonna get, I am gonna get wrecked, is what is gonna happen here. Oh, I should have I should have used dash first. Nope, okay, I can still use it. Okay. It's clear. Hurry before they strike. I'm trying. Oh jeez, there's enemies up there that I didn't notice. Oh, I have oh no. Jeez, this is bad. We can switch. Okay, we don't have enough. Dang it, I knew it. Okay, I'm doing it. Made it in time. I don't know why she doesn't just go, hey, unless they're the two different Git Yankee groups and they don't get along. Like, 
I thought I thought they were coming to rescue her, or at least knew she was there. I think this is supposed to be my character, but she was the one who was like, "I gotta do it," and I was like, "Okay, you can do it then." <laughs> She's also Gith, who has been fighting Illithids for a long time. I assume they would have studied their tactics, you know? Like, the Gith would have studied Illithid tactics, and they know how the machinery works probably better than anybody else, because for one thing, they were enslaved to them for a long time, and now they've taken that knowledge and they're using it against them. So, you know? I figured, I figured well, I'd listen to her. She knows what she's doing. The, th the dead three, Baal, Bane, and Mirkal were all once more. Dang it, you're gonna pop up cool stuff, you gotta let me read it. Flows from Erebor all the way to Baldur's Gate. I hope we get to actually go to Baldur's Gate. <laughs> I hope that's the city in the, in the screen, like in the main screen. Look, legit, I don't know. I, I know that I knew that there was a mind worm, and I know of the companions. That's all I got. Wow, my textures are not loading in. <laughs> Some of them, whoopsie dizzy. Oh, I think she's an evil person that you can like romance, but she's not a companion. Like I said, I looked up the companions and who's romanceable. I'm invested, all right? I have to have at least a little bit of a game plan going in. Oh, hi. I, what? I just got hit in the face with like a rock and I fall out? Also, I'm not gonna lie, for whatever reason, they, that illustrated looked like a dad figure. I don't know, I don't know what it is. I was like, bye dad, it was like my, my impulse. Or hi, Dad, rather, and then I got thrown out. I feel like it should have taken something bigger to knock me out, not just get hit in the face. I've already lost my friends. And what good friends they were going to be, I could tell. They were just the most charming of women. Oh my gosh, I'm beautiful. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. <sighs> It's a horrible way to think about it. Oh, that's a horrible way. Uh, ah, I'm fine. Chaos Where did I land? The land? crash site confuses the landscape. You'll need to find a settlement or landmark, and you'll need to do it quickly. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. I would assume, given how big the game is, that. We're gonna find a cure relatively quickly. I don't think that can, because she said, she said it needs to happen in a few days. So, I don't think the game, how much that's gonna happen is gonna take place within a few days. So hopefully we find the cure soon. And then, or we, I guess maybe we can put like a delay on it. Maybe that's what'll happen. Uh, like a pause button of some sort. Um, because I'm like, I feel like the cure is probably part of, like, the end game, but it can't be at this rate. Hang on, is there a way? Oh, I can't, like, look up. I want to see the tentacle bit that's fallen. Oh, and you can see it. Oh, cool. So, it t yeah, it totally has changed the landscape. The map reflects that. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call this one here. Uh, I realize maybe not a ton happened, but I'm still getting my bearings, still figuring things out. So, thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. This is the part where I normally say thank you to my patrons while I'm recording the video, but this is editing squirrel because there was a recent change to patron stuff, uh, to patron people, so I'm paying attention and I'm including that. So really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to every single one of you, including the acorns. Thank you so much, Adam, for your support at the acorn tier patron, and thank you so much, Bane, for your support at the acorn tier patron level. Uh, and I want to give a special shout out to Reese Galito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. You've been supportive for a very long time and I appreciate that. And I want to give an extra 
extra special shout out to Christopher, who is my Boris tier patron and has gone above and beyond in his support of the channel for a long time now, and who is just super supportive and super wonderful with comments all the time. I really appreciate you a lot. I hope you know that. So thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.